How you going everyone? Corey Baker here. Here we go. I've got this binder. I uh, bought a binder for my all my tops cards and I put them all in and it looks really cool. But I've got all these spare spare pages left and that's because I found out after I get after getting the whole tops collection that was only series 1. I found out there is a series 2 and uh, I bought it and I've never looked through them. So I thought we'd look through series two of the Topps cards together because I'm pretty sure there's some pretty awesome cards in here. So let's get right into it. And I'd say that this marks the end of the card videos for a while. Cause, um, last five videos or three videos have all been on Jurassic Park cards. And uh, these are the last ones I need to go. So I um, hope you enjoyed the little, like the card recap. And I think these are the last ones. So I'm going to look out for the uh, the Lost World tops cards, but they're a little bit rare, so I might not get hold of them very soon. But anyway, let's go and have a look at series two of the Jurassic Park tops cards. First of all. Uh, top Series 2 didn't come with holographic cards, but they did come with stickers. So first of all, we're going to have a look at the stickers before we get into the main um, collection. Here's a cool spitter card. That's cool. And these are all basically um, can be joined together to have the old Brachiosaurus jumping up uh, to eat some leaves seen. So there it is. This, all these stickers join up. Uh, to make that, but for now we're just going to have a look at the uh, stickers. Rap attack. Pretty cool. That's a little bit dodgy, that one. <laughs> That's funny, it's a different kind of, he never really has his mouth closed when you see the T-Rex. T-Rex Rampage, that's a pretty cool um, sticker. So yeah, that's that can all be joined up. So there are the stickers. I'm first time seeing them. Now this is what I'm looking forward to. I'm just looking forward to what we've got to look at in these. And by the look of it, they're really colorful, just like the first series. So let's get into it. I'm excited. Well, wonder what we'll see. All right, first up we've got all new second series. And here we've got the contents. And what have we got in the contents? We've got title card, that's no, basically this one, the dinosaurs. And then we've got dinosaur art, and then we've got the behind the scenes. So that's what we've got to look at in this collection. Anyway, that's the first card. Second card. Awesome Velociraptor, Roar of the Raptor. And then we've got some really cool Velociraptor skull pictures. And these add on to the numbers of your already collection. If you're, you've already got a collection of tops, it follows on for the numbers. So this is 90 and that was 89. So it follows on from the last collection. So that's really awesome. Next one we got, Distracting the Tyrant Queen. Very cool name, very nice colorful card and Look, that's a very different picture than what you usually see. That's I don't I don't think I've ever seen that picture anywhere. Because usually, obviously, they're very similar pictures, but this is like a variant of the famous picture they took of the T-Rex looking at Alan Grant. So that's very cool. And there's a picture of Alan Grant with the flare on the back. Next, we've got an awesome picture of. The Dilophosaurus, likable but lethal. That's very cool. And then we've got some really awesome Crash Mercury artwork on the other side. So that's a really cool picture. That's another picture you don't usually really see. They, they don't seem to be very good pictures, but they're different. So that's what's awesome. Here we got Tim looking at the the fallen friend. Tim's absolutely shitting himself there. Next we've got the Up From The Depths. Up, no, Up From Time's Depths. 
and that's a really cool picture of the Velociraptor. See, these are all different pictures we don't normally have a look at. And there's a picture of him popping his head up from a different angle, which we don't usually see either. So all these pictures are really cool. You've seen this one before, the first sighting of the BRAC. That's a really cool picture. And then there's a picture of them feeding the Brachiosaurus in the tree. We've seen that before. This one looks just like an uh, on-set picture of the Velociraptor poking his head into the power room. And this one's called Monstrous Invader. And on the other side, there is a unique look at the Velociraptor loading scene at the very front of the movie. So these cards are really awesome. Next one is, looks like a Velociraptor one, and it is. And that's another picture which is we've seen similar versions of, but it's another variant like that that I can definitely tell that this is the first time I've seen this um, this kind of picture it says Jurassic Predators where they're not really Jurassic Predators are they they're Cretaceous Predators but we'll let that go it doesn't really matter and here's Grant telling that kid to like stop making fun of his Raptors have a little bit of respect next we've got Laura Dern putting her hand in some shit. And uh, this is a big pile of, look, that's what it says there. They didn't want to write the, the shit word there. But that's a very funny picture, which I've never seen before. First time seeing that picture too. And that's the first time seeing that picture too. That looks like a on-set, um, on-set photo. And it is, because there's some random behind them. So very unique. And there is the Velociraptor calling. Deaf, deaf in the doorway. And there's the two kids hiding. I've seen that one before. Seen kind of both of them before. Night of the Spitter. There is Dennis Nedry looking at. The thing is, the Dilophosaurus isn't even looking at Dennis Nedry. These are like on set pictures, which we don't get to see very often. And uh, there's John Hammond and Dennis Nedry having a bit of a talk about money. The Gallimima Stampede, that's a very awesome picture from the movie. Now we've just a picture of the three people. Hunter and the Hunted. Another picture of the Velociraptor coming from below. And that's a picture we've seen before too. Just kind of ease up a little bit and we'll go on. Next one we've got, we've got the past comes alive and the T-Rex is looking into the kids uh, in the Explorer and there's a very funny photo of De Niro on the toilet as the Tyrannosaurus rips down the toilet. Cunning, this is a really cool unset picture. Cunning of the creature. Weird name, but it's really cool because you can see the camera there and they're filming the raptor in the kitchen scene. And that's, I haven't seen that before, that picture. And there's a picture of John Hammond looking at the plans for the power shed. That's a cool picture and a cool card. The Brax at Midnight. I love that scene where you just sit here, the Brachios singing. They're singing. I love that bit. That's a really cool picture. That is a dinosaur down below. That's another picture, two pictures we haven't really seen before. Well, I haven't anyway. And there's the Mighty T-Rex. This is the different kind of one I said would look different on the stickers. We've seen that one of Ian Malcolm before. There's uh, Laura Dern and little Tim looking at the Triceratops. Dr. S makes a park call. <laughs> Dr. S. All right, that's pretty cool. Here we go, Monster and the Moral. That's a very cool artwork. You've, I've seen that before, but that's... What we're looking at here is the artwork on the wall of the restaurant bit of the visitor center. And I haven't seen that in that view too many times before. So these cards are very cool. I've seen this before, this is really cool, the Raptor's Revenge. And uh, there's Muldoon looking at the footprints, I presume. 
Next one we've got is a clip from the movie uh, when you, the Grant and Allie looks at the dinosaurs in the pond. And here is another really cool picture. We can see the the Velociraptor just there, and uh, when it's when um, Alan Grant drops Tim on the floor, scrambling for safety. I'm loving these pictures, these rare looking pictures I haven't really seen before. That's a really cool picture of the T-Rex there. They're just, they're basically, we've seen them all before, but they're just like slight variants and they're just really cool because you often see the same ones, but these are different. The T-Rex gets the goat. Alright, Prowling for Prey, and this one's a very colourful card, and I love it. That's a really cool card. And here's Alan Grant with his shotgun. Man Against Dinosaur. That's very cool. See, oh, that's what I'm talking about. We usually see this picture. It's a very common picture. And that one... That one isn't. So that's that's another variant. You know, I've never actually seen that one before as well. All right, next one. We've got hide and seek for real. See, we've seen a similar card in the series one of tops, but it's uh, just another variant. And there's Lex crawling on the floor. It's a really cool picture. Scientist at work in the caravan. Here we go, ahead of her game. Yeah, that's the boss right coming out. And see what I mean? Like we've seen so many of these pictures of the raptor coming up above and that they're all different. Here we are, we've got the seeking seeking a snack and a half. John Hammond looking very concerned. This is another really cool. A uh, picture of the Velociraptor and a card, and it's called Target Maldoon, and it's a very cool card. Here's the Brachiosaurus jumping up. Jurassic Park's Friendly Giant, with a unique look at that picture. Here's a famous Crash Mercury artwork, Terror of the T-Rex, which is almost like a concept artwork for the movie and that's a that's another photo we haven't really seen before look that's, that's I've never seen this photo ever these these cards are really good look at this this is really good to look at as well look Rex and the river rafters this is of, of this is from the book see many secrets you can pause the video whenever you want to read these some of them are very interesting See, like this one, many sequences planned for Jurassic Park were scrapped. So imagine looking, imagine watching that in the movie. Look at this picture. This is a very famous picture too. Rex's Savage Assault. They're all concept arts. Artwork. They're all concept artworks for the movie. And I've seen that one before. I've, no, I've never seen that concept artwork ever. Really interesting stuff. Look at this one. Raptors in our Raptors in our midst. They're climbing on a stegosaurus skeleton instead of the skeletons we see in the movie. Really fascinating. Now we're looking at this part of the collection. This is the Jurassic Park special effects secrets. So it'll be interesting to see what they have to say. Here we go, we've got Steven Spielberg and I think that is Kathleen Kennedy. Yep, Spielberg, Kennedy and friend. All right, Winston's Brachiosaur. What a bloody legend that guy was. Behind the scenes pictures. Look at that one, that's a really good picture. I have seen this one before, A Day of the Raptors. There he is. Look fantastic, don't they? I've seen that one before. They like they're wiping down the T Rex because he was in the rain. The fantastic Rex head. 
Imagine, seriously, imagine going to work as an actor and you have to act, act with this thing. Amazing, imagine what that'd feel like. Ailing Triceratops scene. Here's another T-Rex headshot. King, queen of the dinos. <laughs> That's interesting. Of, of science and Syrians. Saurians. Really interesting cards. I really like these. this series too. Nice jacket, Stephen. The master director. He is. He's a bloody good director. What we got next? Look at that one. I don't think I've ever seen that picture of Stan Winston and the Velociraptor like that. That's an awesome picture. Man-made monsters. So good. Here we go, Maldoon and the Raptors. That's a very cool on-shot, on-set picture. Here we go, directing dinos and their prey. Here's where Maldoon dies. Look at that, that's funny. I don't know if that's Maldoon. I think that could be a stunt double. Advice and adjustments. Really cool. Filming the hatchery. Another awesome scene of the movie. What's this one? He's almost like the T-Rex dentist here. Inside the jaws of death. Very dramatic name for the card. Here we go. The colours of these cards are even better than the original um, series one. Soothing the rev soothing the savage beast. Brachiosaurus isn't really a savage beast. Although maybe they're talking about the movie. The director's director. Really cool. Bring Rex to life. It's quite. We're up to 143. So a lot of cards. Here's the legs of the Tyrannosaurus. The project, the pro, this project has legs. Very funny. I like the, like the puns they use in the names of these cards. Massive undertaking. I'm usually uh, these are really cool set photos. Crichton's brainchild. This is the guy that came up with the whole idea. What a legend. More than a mere monster. The boy and the beasts. There's a T-Rex foot. More monster miracles. <laughs> Isn't that a great photo? I don't think I've ever seen that photo. Lights, camera, dino action. There's an awesome picture of like what behind the scenes of uh, Nedry and the Dilophosaurus. Bigger and nastier than life. There's Laura Dern with the, look she's got the T-Rex toe on top of her. Now, I've never seen that picture. That's pretty funny. Coming to the last ones now. Cam Cat Cinema's Greatest Showman. Yep, I think that's true. Look at that, that's a cool picture. Second last card. A whale of a tail. And the last card we've got to show you guys is, if I can pick it up, another walk in the park. There you go, Lex, there. What an awesome card collection, guys. I'm gonna put that into my binder now, if they'll fit. I think there's, I don't know if they'll fit, because I think there's too many now. So here's the binder. I put them all in, and they only just fit all in. So, I'm absolutely stoked. So I've got the whole collection on display now, I'm in this nice little binder. All right, guys, thanks for watching this far into the video, but uh, thanks for coming with me on this card journey. I've 
had a great time. I'm going to move away from cards now and get into more things. We've got Jurassic June coming up next month in about a couple of weeks. So I'll be going into some Papo dinosaurs and some dinosaur figurines. And I'll be doing... Uh, that Toy Fair is coming up in about a week's time. So I'm going to go and try and find some more Jurassic Park gems from the 90s at that Toy Fair coming up very soon. So subscribe for more. Leave a comment. I always love seeing you guys comment on my videos and like talking to you guys about some stuff. So uh, I'll catch you next time. Stay tuned. See you later.